Hi guys, welcome to Sports First TV. Um, we're delighted to have one of um, the very first Sports First family members, uh, Nick Elder. Uh, Nick has played for a number of teams, including age group, New Zealand representative, hockey and NHL. Hi Nick, how's it going? Yeah, good mate, good to be here. Um, I'm just going to ask you a few questions um, about your hockey so your fans and your following can sort of know a little bit more about you. Uh, when, uh, What made you start playing hockey and when did, uh, when did it all start? Uh, I started when I was about 9 or 10 and just went down to mini hockey down down the deep south and had a wee play around and I uh, quite enjoyed it so yeah I just kept playing along and yeah loved it. So whereabouts um, in the South Island are you exactly from? Um, Rosedale, so that's, it's not Gore, but it's 20 minutes out of Gore, so um, yeah, that's a nice little town down there, and yeah, it's always good to go home and work there over summer, and do a bit of training. So it's probably not a place that you'd associate hockey with? Nah, more rugby, definitely rugby, so yeah, love my rugby. Right, along the way, is there any person or anyone that you've looked up to for inspiration or motivation? Uh... Not really, probably my probably my flatmates that I played with at the start of the year, Kane and Blair, they're, they're great hockey players and great trainers and um, it was good getting an insight into how hard they work um, to be able to play at the international level and to a high standard. So yeah, they're, they're people I probably look up to the most. Yeah, it's um, pretty much a hockey flat, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, and our other flatmate Jeremy was in there, he's also, uses a stick, so. Um, what has been the highlight for your hockey career so far? Uh, probably going to the, the Junior World Cup in 2013, we went to New Delhi and we came seventh over there but it was a great learning experience and it was good getting an insight into the Indian culture over there. And the Indian food, well, not yeah, so much. Yeah, Indian food, yeah. yeah. Um, making the move from the bottom of the South Island to Auckland has come with challenges. Can you tell us about some of these challenges and how you've addressed them? Uh, Starters probably traffic. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Oh, where I come from, there's probably never any, any traffic or anything. So, um, yeah, it's one thing I've had to adapt to, and obviously more people around. But um, also, it's, it's different having to meet a lot, not uh, a lot more people. And um, yeah, I really that's the thing I've enjoyed the most: getting to know other people from different reg regions and different clubs up here. And yeah, it's something I really enjoy. Great. Um, this season you've had a bit of a niggling injury, um, and obviously NHL week's coming up now next week. What are you looking to? Uh, what are you looking up to most for the week in terms of the experience? So I guess it's a, you know it's probably your fifth or sixth NHL. Yeah. Um, what do you think you're looking forward to the most? Uh, just getting out there and playing some hockey. Um, it's, it's tough sometimes when you sit on the sideline and have to watch for half the season, but no, nah, yeah, looking forward to getting out there and having a run around with the lads, and hopefully we get some. Good results if we if we play well. Great, and of course uh, Nick will be playing for um, Harbour this year, so we've got a pretty good team and yeah, looking pretty fit and healthy. So look forward to some good results. Um, you're also using the Princess SG9 um, stick. Um, what do you think it makes it ideal or well suited to, to your game? Um, I think it's just it's a good all round stick. It's good for um, passing. It's got a lot of power to it, and it's also it's quite a soft feel to it. So it means when you, when you trap it, it's nice and easy, and I, I find it doesn't bounce off much. And yeah, I, I think it's just it's got a good balance to it as well. So it's a stick I really enjoy using. Cool, yeah, it's certainly one of our um, popular models in the store. Um, lastly, have you got a message for any young players aspiring to play representative hockey and I guess uh, make it to where you're at at the moment? Um, obviously, the school hockey tournament's just finished last week, and we have under 13 and under 15 uh, regional tournaments coming up as well. Uh, probably just keep working hard. Um, it's sometimes I guess things don't always go to plan, but if you always um, chip away, the results will they'll eventually come for you. So I think it's just a matter of um, yeah, sticking sticking true to what you know and um, working hard outside of hockey. So training hard and studying hard, whatever. Awesome. Well, thanks, Nick, for your time. I really appreciate you um, giving some of your time. I know you're a busy man, and NHL is going to start this Sunday. Um, so all the best for that week, and um, hopefully things go uh, well for you, and no injuries, and, and your team gets up there and wins the cup. Thank you. Thanks for the continuous support.